Hello everyone, this is Xander Turon, and I'm back with my 20th anniversary Let's Play of StarCraft. Today we're doing Protoss Mission 3, Higher Ground. Executor, I bring news most dire. The Cerebrid that we thought we had killed has arisen again. The creature's battered form was reincarnated despite the considerable damage we inflicted upon it. Even now, the Cerebrate drives its brood in preparation for their next offensive. It is as I feared. It was folly to believe Tassadar could be trusted. The Conclave will not soon forget his wanton betrayal. Nevertheless, we must stand resolute. For attacking defenseless Cerebrates is not the way of true Protoss warriors. We shall overcome the entire swarm with the might and the fury that is our heritage. Executor, we shall lead our main strike force to the province of Sion, which has fallen to the Zerg. It's time the Zerg felt the wrath of the Sons of Ayr. Prayer to Phoenix will remain here with a small detachment and guard Antioch from any further assaults. Hadoon be with you, Executor. Bring swift death to the enemies of Ayr. Okay. Yeah, simple mission. Destroy some Zerg. Not gonna have Phoenix with us in this mission, though. Shame. He's a pretty cool guy. Hope nothing bad happens to him. Oh, new unit right off the bat. Got scouts. There. Yeah. Let's warp and the probes. Actually, that gives us a fairly decent chunk of minerals right off the bat. Let's get a gateway. <coughs> there we go. Anyway, saying so, it's a scout. It's their standard Protoss air unit. Pretty tough, very expensive. It's very good against air units. Uh, it's like a Wraith in that regard. It's very good against uh, air units. Against ground units is pretty useless though. It's kind of a bad joke, really. Pylons, because pylons are cool. I like pylons. I feel the need to construct additional ones. Alright, gateways here. Very nice. Now I just need to get a forge. And a cybernetics core, and I should be good to go. <coughs> Forge, 150. Hey, look, pylon. Yeah. Start it off. Start me off with a decent enough force that I don't need to worry too much about getting a bunch of units out quickly, but. I think I need to start getting more units out. There's, there's some Zerg that need uh, that need to be taken care of. Quite a few Zerg, in fact. Is that next core? Yeah, it's just 200. You have not enough minerals. Of course, I actually need to have the minerals in order to do it first. Don't mind me. Hello. Do you mind not? Anyways, I was saying, Cybernet score. That's, that's the thing. Ooh, got a critter. There we go. And more Zerg on the way. Oh, 
Get back here. There we go. Construct additional pylons over here. Let's get a couple of zealots, I suppose. Probes, because I need to start getting my Vespane going. <clears throat> and see, so at the Semi Square, we do have our air weapons and armor upgrades. Building's just gonna be Starport and Citadel of Dune. I think if I want a Citadel of Dune. Maybe not immediately. Let's get another pylon. Hey. Nice. Off to a brilliant start. Then I probably shouldn't even put my pylon or my photon cannon so close to my pylons. Probably not necessary. And that should be enough. Enough cannon. Um, get a Citadel of a Dune. That is upgrades for Zealots there. Here we go. If I put another pile on there. Wait. See what you're doing. That is very. I should have cancelled that before it got destroyed. That's very rude of them. Now. All right. Let's get ground or don't mm, shields. Let's do shields. Buff up everything. And here we go. We have develop leg enhancements, faster zealot movement. It's pretty handy. Minerals, well. I also forget about singularity charge. And yeah, I'll get leg enhancement. Then we're gonna leave space for shield battery. If I put one there. And not really good if I had a singing head I would have not had my gateway there, maybe a bit more over there. Oh, bother. Anyway, let's get leg enhancement. Oh. Oh. I require more Vespin gas. Don't mind me. Anyway, you. B. Yeah, that's B as well. B for battery.
yeah, that's just not a good layout. Yeah, I don't need it there. Don't mind me, I'm indecisive. And let's just get a few more zealots. Is that in range? Or does it not work on buildings? I can't remember. I don't think it actually works on buildings. I might be an idiot. Or it has to be right next to him. I haven't played this game for. I haven't played Protoss in this game in years. Literally years. So a lot of what I remember is pretty spotty. And think about it. I guess I'll get a Stargate once I have enough. Yeah, 150, 150. And meanwhile, I'm gonna use my scouts to well scout. Imagine that. They are pretty fast, so. Or not like super fast, but they're decently fast. Do you believe there's an expansion relatively close by? Zergen here, yep. Yeah. Is that the red or the white? White. Oh, okay, Scourge. Let's just be cautious around that. Bengalas. Okay. Actually, let's just swing up around. Okay. Right, which is kind of a large plateau area. So, okay, it's almost done. Let's get that. Very rude of him. Anyway, what is he doing? Sure, let's get air weapons. Darn, Zerg keep wrecking my stuff. Oh, nope. Alright, so there's some hydras over there. Keep that in mind. And you. Get me a star date. The enemy. Oh, I made a mistake. That's why I need to pay attention. So that's where the red is. Very nice. He's still trying to chase me. Okay. There's two ramps going up there. Here's somewhere I could expand. Not immediately. Sorry, you're right. Just don't forget about this guy. So now my zealot should be Sanic fast. Well, I want to expand, but I'm probably going to need to take care of some Zerg first. Uh, do I want another gateway, maybe? Do I really have the room for one? Guess. I could help. 
And in the meanwhile, let's get more pylons. So yeah, pretty expensive. 275 minerals, 125 Vespane, 3 Psy, or Supply, whatever you want to call it. Not an insignificant investment at all. Hey, stay away from my Dragoons. They really do not do well against Dragoons. One there, obviously, plus two. Nice. Who do I want to hit first? down ramps. Another place I can expand. This one's a little bit more accessible. I do enjoy that. Alright, we're in the very edge of Zerg Creek. Volunteered to go over there. <coughs> Start working on expansion, and then I'll probably get to attack the red just because they are right next to the expansion. complete. 
There we go. Of course. Should have seen that coming. No, nope, keep running, keep running. Delightful. Well, not that that's out of the way. Okay, whatever. Stop trying to double click like a moron. These guys can go over here. There we go. Resource situation's not too bad, so I'll feel okay queuing up a few guardian or guardians. Don't know why I call me that. Scouts. Jeez. And since mutilists are now going to be coming from there, I guess I'll get a couple more cannons. that carefully so I don't block this guy in by accident. Very nice. How close is this? Almost there. Spending most of my minerals. Mostly just to ward off any Zerg attacks, just build, drop a couple cannons. I overdone it, but hey, who cares? See if I can get a dozen dragoons down a ramp without it turning into an absolute horrific mess. Very nice. Warriors have engaged the enemy. 
Okay, I did not think that up. So let's grab these guys. Stay Not a lot of spore colonies, so I can just mass these guys and pick away. I think the other. <coughs> oh, you're coughing. I think the white Zerg base has a lot more anti air defense, if I recall correctly. I saw the Scourge, but they flew past it. Can't remember anything specifically, though. that. Two ways down. Well, scout with my scouts. There we go. That set up. There we go. Idle workers, bad workers. Oh, that's lovely timing. I guess I have to go scatter all over the map. Oh, 
Unit preservation and micromanagement, what is that? Okay. Not the case the joint. Got some air defense. Okay, let's get this organized. Okay. This should be enough to cause some trouble. Focus on that because that's the most dangerous thing in the game. Yeah. I lose, so that's like nobody's business. Let's just get another boatload of these guys going. Whatever, let's commit the Guardians to the fight now. Oh yeah, get some Scourge. You must hold your position for as long as possible. Fight on, brave Phoenix, and know that the gods watch over you. Entaro Adun. All oh, right, I win. Let's not to turn my Wi-Fi off again. <sighs> Whatever. No, pretty simple mission. Fight some Zerg, kill some Zerg, win. Ooh, let's wait up bump my microphone. Lost a lot of Zealots. A few Dragoons. Definitely could have managed that a bit better. Instead of just, you know, attack moving it, you know, my forces into the middle of the enemy base and hoping for the best. It's not quite StarCraft 2 where you can just death ball with the Protoss. Oh, oh, oh. Seriously, Legacy of the Void campaign was so easy. Well, later missions were really easy. Anyway, I digress.
as yeah, fun, fun times for the Protoss, however, looks like things aren't looking too good for Phoenix. Hope nothing bad happens to him. He's a pretty cool guy. It'd be a shame if something bad happened to him. And, yeah, call it here. I'm Xander Churon, and this was Protoss Mission 3. I'll see you guys in the next mission. Take care now.